What's up guys and welcome back to another video right into my YouTube channel. Today I'm gonna basically tell you how to fix every kind of server issue or error you're currently having with Ghost Recon Wildlands. Before we start right into the video guys, I just want you to, to you guys know or let you guys know that I would really really appreciate it if you would just leave a like, a comment or a subscription right into my YouTube channel. It would really make my day and help me out as a little YouTuber as I am. Especially subscribing would be such a big support for me guys. You would support my work on YouTube a little bit and I'm gonna really really be thankful for that and I'm gonna thank you for that. So anyways, I would just say let's get right started. So the first step I would recommend doing for everybody is gonna be to take your keyboard. You're gonna hit the Windows and the R key at the same time. The run tab will pop up and I want you to type in CMD. Once you type in CMD, hit OK or enter. This will make this tab pop up and I want you to type in what I'm going to type in. So IP config space slash flush DNS. Hit enter. Once it is successfully flushed, as you can see, you should be able to end this task again. Navigate to the bottom left corner of your screen, click into the window symbol, click into the setting symbol and navigate right into network and internet. We want you to hit network and sharing center and click into the blueprint of text where it says troubleshoot problems. You're going to use your windows in order to find any kind of issue you currently have on your PC with servers and network in, uh, and connection in general. Hit internet or ethernet, it just depends on which one you're currently using and which is blueprinted, so click on that, it doesn't really matter. Hit properties, double click internet protocol version four and enable use the following DNS server addresses. So for these, you're gonna just Google them. So click onto Google and type in pre preferred DNS server addresses and alternate DNS server address and type it in or four times eight to the top and two times four and two times eight to the bottom. Click okay and apply and this will fix your issue guys. That's it for the video. I hope that I could actually help you out of this one. If it was like that, just leave a like, a comment, or a subscription. I'm gonna really be thankful for that. And I guess I'm really sorry if I couldn't help you, but I'm just gonna do my best in order to help you out. Either way, I hope you guys have one of late. See you at the next one, and bye.